Why drink just shit? I mean, no. Well, that's why. Uh... Al Maz Cafe Jesus, which is even more Jesus with coffee in Spanish, as translated by an asshole. <laughs> um, the so here's what it looks like. Yup, look, it's really dark. How many times am I gonna say that? Not, not too many more. We're just eventually gonna have to accept the fact that every evil twin stout looks like something that would come out of your car. And it is absolutely wonderful to give a, give a smell to. The odor of this, you're gonna smell actually the hops kind of as a bunch of dark fruit notes. Maybe a little bit of like cloving or cloves or, or floral notes too. And the taste of it. Oh, good heavens. That is, you're gonna get your good cup of coffee in it right away. So the even more Jesus on its own is known for its big dark fudge body and the coffee added to this is gonna come right away. Actually, it's the very first thing that you're gonna taste when you take a sip of this. And the coffee doesn't so much lead, I would say, as much as it just blends really seamlessly with the fudge body. They definitely used some high quality coffee beans, at least that's what they allege, and I'm not gonna dispute them. You, these do seem to be really good ones. The scent of it, which we've already discussed, that those uh, dark fruit notes, you're gonna taste those a little bit again right at the end. There is that bitterness that bleeds on leaves on the back of your tongue, maybe like mid tongue, I suppose. That's how I'd describe it. It's actually a really nice, refreshing way to finish the beer. I would never call this beer actually like a thirst quencher by any stretch of the imagination, but I kind of like having that light fruitiness at the very, very end of the beer. I think it's a very nice touch and it rounds it out really, really nicely. So overall, if I had to rate this beer, it's uh, pretty well regarded on them, their interwebs, but I think this is a solid example of a four star beer. And I would also even go so far as to say that it is a cut above as well because of the excellent use of the coffee to add to the body of an already excellent model for a wonderful multi stout. And if you can find any around you, it's definitely worth picking up. Just, you know, it is, I don't know, what is it, like 15% or something like that? ABV? It, it's a high ABV. 12. That might, 12? Okay, it's 12% ABV. So, you know, take it, drink it slow. Don't drink too much at once. Split it with a friend. Cheers.